Welcome to part five of our series, Secrets of Glessner House. Today, we are in the Glessner's first floor master bedroom, looking at their coal burning fireplace, which is faced with beautiful hand painted tiles designed by William de Morgan. Coal was used in most of the bedrooms as it would burn much longer than wood, making it practical for overnight use. The Glessner's burned cannel coal, the most expensive type available. It was known for being very hard with a high oil content, which resulted in it burning longer, producing little ash, and having a bright, clean yellow flame. You will notice a small door to the right of the fireplace. This conceals the dumbwaiter, which was used to deliver coal to the room and carry away the ash, thus eliminating the need for these dirty materials to be carried through the house. The dumbwaiter operated with pulleys and weights connected to heavy metal chains that would be pulled to raise and lower a box into which the brass coal scuttle, shown to the left of the dumbwaiter, would fit. We will see where the dumbwaiter goes in just a moment. The name dumbwaiter comes from its ability to act as a silent servant, using the outdated term dumb for someone who does not speak. Dumbwaiters were widely used in Europe, where they were most commonly used to carry food from basement kitchens to first floor dining rooms. Thomas Jefferson is generally credited with bringing the idea back to the United States from France. Let's look inside the dumbwaiter now to see what the shaft looks like. You will see two of the three chains that were used to raise and operate it. The third chain is now broken and missing. Let's head down one level to see where the dumbwaiter goes. We are now in the schoolroom located directly below the master bedroom. Through this door made of brass, you can see the bottom portion of the dumbwaiter. It was from the schoolroom, which is at basement level, where coal would be sent up and ashes removed. A piece of the heavy metal chain which has broken off is shown laying on the hearth. Dumbwaiters are still used in larger homes today to transport food and other items, although most are now mechanized eliminating the need to pull the chain or rope by hand. This concludes our series, Secrets of Glessner House. We hope you have enjoyed these videos and will visit to experience the secrets in person.